In the designing of electronics enclosures, we often encounter wire harnesses running along complicated 3D paths. This is a quick tutorial on how we can model them. The main learning points of this video are as follows. 3D sketching and sweeping with twist. So let's take a look at the final result first. So I have an electronics enclosure here with two boards. On each of these two boards, there is a connector. Joining these two connectors is a twisted wire harness following a 3D path. So let's start with the tutorial. I have created a new component here named harness. And it is currently activated. I have also created a plane that roughly bisects the connector here along its thickness. I shall start a sketch on the plane that bisects the connector. Before sketching, go to the sketch palette and check the 3D sketch option. Let's start with the first segment. Now, I want the next segment to go down to the base of the housing. This would obviously involve sketching on a plane that is different from the current sketch plane. Try to position the model and the line in a way that triggers the 3D sketching axis. You might have to do this multiple times. Once the axis appears, you will be able to use that as a guide. There is no shortcut key to trigger this 3D sketching axis you would have to try your best to be accurate in positioning your line in a way so as to hint to the program that you are trying to do a 3D sketch. Continue to draw the rest of the path. You will not be able to drag the 3D sketch in a normal fashion. To make adjustments, start the move command. Select segments or points and shift accordingly. You can move multiple segments at a time. Next, use the fillet tool to round off sharp corners of the path. To create a sketch profile for the sweep, we first need a plane that is normal to the path at the starting point. Go to Construct Plane along path. Select the path near the starting point and set the distance to 0. Create a cross section of the wire harness on the newly created plane. This will depend on the number and diameter of the wires you need. Go to Create, Sweep. Select Profile and Path accordingly. For Twist Angle, enter a value in multiples of 360. A 360 sweep will produce a single revolution. Enter a value that will give you the desired outlook. 